Welcome to SIPCalculation.com. We have software to do the SIP loading monitor to check the SIP stability in your vessel. So this is just example from the another vessel. And then this uh, calculation being checked by the classification and then we have the report for the approval one. Okay, so now we generate the software to make it easy the captain or chip engineer to monitoring the ship stability of the vessel okay so this one is the light ship crew deck cargo fresh water uh, nail point oil but all this uh, tank capacity is based on the uh, ship stability booklet so let's say that you have the ship stability booklet then we are going to update based on the ship, uh, ship stab your ship stability booklet from the classification of popular so here go the uh, can calculate the maximum drum maximum vcg gm and then the got the protein status also drop up drop mischief and then drop forward trim hill and then here got center of gravity longitudinal center of gravity transfer center of gravity vertical center of gravity and then there is a dead weight and displacement okay let's say that we are when you change the deck cargo or the uh, uh, volume of the tank here this one will become uh, changed even the percentage of the tank also will become changed let's say now this one is a pool uh, oil tank number one is the 85 yeah. okay starboard side huh? so I just go to starboard side so this one is a starboard side this one is a 100% so I make it uh, change to 12 ton See, this one become changed 92.63 and then displacement also will become changed that way also change and then everything drop up drop missive and then drop forward also change and you can see here the repute drop here okay this one we can make it same also with your face also they lay out everything so uh, okay this is the uh, display uh, screen to show you the ship loading monitor okay and then uh, you need to edit right so edit cover report is based on your name of the vessel voice to edge uh, your chip engine the master name and then document number and then after that you can save it uh, even though also the project name for the uh, lamp this one everything will be filled up okay based on your vessel uh, condition of this one is the input principal dimension of the vessel. They have to then save it. So after all the info with this, is the, the correct one, uh, the percentage, uh, let's say they pull the facture, you need to make it 98 first time for the volume of the 10, and then how much the maximum deck cargo you need also to highlight, okay, based on the ship stability booklet. And then after that, you can just do the analysis, pull the facture loading condition. And the calculation has been successfully run and then just okay right so this one should be okay but let's say that how to know that uh, our vessel uh, able to carry the cargo limit so let's say this one this cargo is only around uh, 60 ton so i would like to make it maybe around 70 ton okay let's say i put here around 50 uh, is it possible to carry with this the, the dispenser here got the sewing later on the warning okay uh, this got the warning maximum drop so uh, everything here got the warning so means that you need to reduce your uh, the cargo weight okay to meet the uh, stability condition so you need to change again become 40 and then become pass already so how to print all the this report and then how to check okay you can see here the print document right here got the cover report the cover report also depends on your uh, uh, cover report for shift stability it's okay this one I just make it simple one you can change also whatever you want here all right then after that you can close you need to see also the uh, uh, result okay for full departure loading condition so you just go to this full departure loading condition here got the report okay this one you can submit also to the
third party to the client to the owner also uh, okay <coughs> but this one this the formula everything from the basic naval architect huh? and then been uh, been checked by the classification so you you are not to worry also but you might double check also the uh, what they call it the result right so here got the book reference uh, let's say that you would like to see the rules on the classification right this one is put the bp profiteritas so just click here bp and then you can see here okay this one is the rules of the classification bp so you can double check also okay the rules content of this the formula so now the zip document report so so that you are not missing the anything your files you don't save it to the another files so here you just go to the stability report and revision zero and they can tell you oh this is the original one just latest revision zero okay then you can close here you got the identity stability also like zip report but let's say that you don't have the identity stability so just make it not available uh, but if you, you have the addendum stability so you, you need to input on this uh, revision zero also or you have the license report also you need to indicate on this license report now you are you would like to see also the general arrangement so you just go to the view and then general arrangement and you can see the general arrangement is here your vessel see this is the general arrangement and you would like to see the tank capacity plan also the tank capacity also available so depends on your phaser we will include everything is here and then go here view drop mark position also you can see uh, this one got the problem with the drop mark okay the one lead no problem so everything here have so easy for you to uh, control your uh, save okay and control with the, the cargo and then the tank also you would like to make it 50 percent so it depends on you lah. okay uh, okay if anything any question uh, you can just drop us to the this here got the customer uh, support right okay this one uh, and then you got the help also about and the manual okay so it's the manual later on we can send to you also once you want to order the, this uh zip loading monitor okay thank you very much for watching and see you for the next topic bye bye